hey guys welcome to my new channel this is my creative channel so i'm so excited and just quickly going into the video the thing i'm going to do today as you see behind me is a diy this is just a basic chest that's how it looks so i'm going to be doing a tutorial hopefully that won't backfire but i'm going to do a tutorial from this brown coffee color i'm going to turn this chest to a white chest i know i'm also excited this is my first diy but i hope it won't backfire on me so basically guys this is the chest uh as i was saying and this is how it looks in the interior i'm not going to touch uh the interior part because i love how brown it is inside i just need the outer part of it white i'm gonna clean those surfaces and it also has let me go up it also has this these are the products i'm going to use i'm going to show you in a bit and that's just how it looks when it's empty at the top part and back here that's how it looks so yeah let me show you the products that i got so guys to begin with i hope it's not so dark i got uh this spray paint from navas it's from the company gb g as you can see and it's on the color white and i got two of them each was i think yeah 250 shillings and i also got this sanding paper for 15 shillings i got two pieces and for the clean cling film i got from the kitchen so this is what i'm going to use to wrap around the hardware so that they don't get paint so let's get started So as you can see, I just wrapped around uh, with a cling film, both on these hard wires so that they don't get the white paint. So what I'm going to do next is by using this, I'm going to just go roughly through uh, this chest, kind of just going into the grain so that once I paint, I can spray it, it can just enter into the furniture kabisa kabisa so let me just get to that then i'm going to show you is a new piece it doesn't have that much rough things to go with so I just buffed it a little bit and sandpapered it down. And yes, yeah, so what I'm going to do next is I'm just going to take a piece of cloth, wipe through it, and make sure it's clean before I get the paint in it. So that's what I'm going to actually do. So uh, for the next step, best thing is to get a damp cloth, not a wet cloth, a damp cloth, and a dry one. So that you can go clean it, then make sure it's dry. For the paint to go in, so that's what I'm gonna do. Heritage, same team from the bus stop, tearing shit up. I be where it's not enough to be. I should have actually removed the hardware, but I don't have the screws. So if you're doing this, make sure you remove the hardware because most of them are held by basic screws. A foster, just make sure you remove them, it will be easier. But I'm not doing that. So the next step is doing the spraying bit. That's the most important part. And I'm going to start uh, with this. Let me just put everything aside. I'm going to start with this side and hope it doesn't backfire on me. So normally there's, uh, I think it's a metallic ball. Make sure you shake it so well before you spray it. And let's just hope and you spray it uh what do they say you hold 15 to 25 centimeters from the object and spray back and forth so i think it's going down this way and uh, for this hardware i don't care about them they may turn whichever color they want to turn 
but I think I'll tell whatever. Caught. I know you're looking at it like it's problematic. No, it's not. It actually looks better uh, in visualize. I don't know why you can't see it as clearly. Sorry. But that's it. And I have three more coats to go. And I also did the top part. So, yeah, I'm going to show you clearly. I don't know why it's not focusing. It's an actual color. It looks like a marble. A marble white. So that's how it looks from afar that's how it looks so yeah i have three more coats then after every 10 minutes put a second coat 10 minutes more third coat and that's how it's going to be so This is the final look for the chest how beautiful does it look it came as white as I wanted it I'm glad it's not cocaine white like the strong strict white that is how it looks as you can see and on top I just placed artifacts a candle I got from my friend and some body creams and how dope is this in unity we stand and we hold the world in unity together. That's dope. And I just got this stand from my mom and this is my camera tripod and that's how it looks. So if you want, if you have a piece in the house that is brown or whichever color and you want it uh, to turn white or marble white as mine did, make sure you just buy the items I showed you guys. It's a simple DIY. And you're gonna achieve this look. 
So don't forget to like uh, this video, give it a thumbs up, make sure you comment on how gorgeous it looks. And I'll see you on the next DIY. Bye guys.